Hello. Hello. Welcome to another one of these videos where we are building these uh, off-brand Lego Speed Champion style cars from AliExpress. So today uh, we have chosen what? <laughs> chosen to build this uh, rally car, which, from the looks of it, it's um, going to be absolutely hard. It's uh, it's very similar to one that Lego did a few years ago, which is this uh, Ford Fiesta Rally Sport version. Thing. Uh, now, I did want to make this uh, video a dual build, where we would build this one, which is in the six wide, smaller format, and build this new one, which is in the eight wide format. But my kids have lost a bunch of the pieces off this, so, uh, and I haven't gone hunting for them yet, so I don't know. Uh, where they are but I remember when I built this one uh, at the time I think this was the best uh, Lego Speed Champions car there was because there was so much detail on it and uh, they covered up virtually all the studs on this model as well like just a few at the back were, co were uh, exposed so it detail wise it was one of the most realistic cars but it's still in that sort of squished uh, six wide format so this one is in the eight wide format so it should be more to scale to the actual car um, so this uh, at first I thought this one was unbranded because we just got a big instruction sheet instead of a regular instruction book uh, there are 73 steps to the instructions and the model is Jesus. the model is numbered Six 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 zero two zero. Um, have a lot of stickers on this one. Big sticker. They're not really a lot. They're just big stickers. Uh, so they're going to cover most of the outside of the car. Uh, there was a bend in the sticker sheet, which has gone through four of the stickers. But hopefully, oh it should look fine. Um, but inside the instruction sheet, there was actually this card. So it is branded as Panlos bricks and I just had a look at their website and uh, well, wouldn't let me go on it. they do they do about 20 uh, cars in this style some of them are clones of last year's 2020 Lego models and some of them are uh, look to be unique but I bet they're based on other people's model designs um, it's all in Chinese this text so uh, I have no idea what it is, I just googled them and found uh, that they have an AliExpress shop as well. So, uh, so that's the brand and the model number is 66020. So, we've already sorted out all the pieces like before. Uh, and even though there are a lot of steps, most of the steps are like literally just three or four pieces. So, I think the instructions look fairly uh, straightforward. So. I'll start building the car and Laura can build the person. So the uh, the person, the pieces of them, it's more like a Mega Block style uh, character rather than a Lego style minifig. And that already just kind of um, makes you think it's lower quality. So I don't know. The, the pieces, the Lego, while I was sorting them, although the, the uh, bricks, blocks, does seem to be... Uh, Lego quality, so I'm hoping the actual build of the car is pretty good. Uh, again, we've got that standard eight wide base plate that we're used to now from from Lego from last year, and that's the starting point for this model. Now the instructions, um, because there's a lot of black, grey, and dark blue pieces. At first, it's quite hard to distinguish between them, but you can actually uh, you can actually tell which really which are which. Dented my thumb that trying to get the arm on. Ow! Uh, you can tell which are which. The black ones have like white outlines around the studs. Uh, the grey ones have black outlines around the studs, and the blue pieces oh. don't have any outlines around their studs. So you can kind of distinguish it, but I think I would advise that you 
uh, pre-stocked pieces like I have. I'm so sorry, Martin. Um, can you please excuse me? I need to put the arm on. I can't get out. The kids can never put their arm on either. It was really hard. It was really stiff. Yeah. Fucking expert here. <laughs> Is this the left hand or the right hand? I don't know. Does it matter what what hand goes on what hand? Ooh. No. As long as the arms are the right way around. Right, the arms. Fucking hell! <laughs> it just pings! It's so tiny. Well, I've managed. Right. I have to get the other one in. So these uh, pieces are clicking together quite nicely. <laughs> and it does. Says he. I can't even come on. Yeah, that, that's what I was saying. The, the figure Jesus. feels like a lower quality. Oh my. Um, Martin, you have to. I'm so, I'm so sorry. <clears throat> can't get our man. Hand. Uh, so also, this set only came with one person. Uh, every other set that we've built so far came with two or three, just like like a official set would. Well, this is a bit strange. Do we put hair on him, or do you want to put the actual mask on him? You normally get hair and helmet. Not in the same bat. You do. What, how they... With the Lego ones, you do. You don't. No, you don't put them on together. It's you either have one or the other. Well, that's exactly what I was saying, and you were like, "No." Nah. Well, it's not strange, is it? I don't even know if I put this on. <laughs> is that one right? No, it's upside down. <laughs> Oh, that, that looks better. Right, there he is. He's got his wee hat on. Doesn't he look beautiful? <laughs> now, what shall we put on? Oh, put on here. You can see this. hundred steps to this. He's put it all out on the table and it took him about three hours just to do that. No, it didn't. Before we actually it took about half in. an hour just like it has for most of the others. And, uh, once once you get like two thirds of the way you've got hardly getting any pieces left to sort out. But sometimes it's just trying to find the exact piece that you want like like these ones, I thought in the instructions they were clear pieces. But they were grey pieces. So, so by the end, I got to the end. It says you need three clear pieces. I'm like, I don't have any. So I had to figure out where I'd gone wrong. Up there. Yeah, I had to figure out where I'd gone wrong because I had clear ones here. So they, they, that was for that stuff. Yeah, right. Uh, so, so the we did actually get some a, extra bits. about eight or nine spare bits. It seems uh, for most of the small little studs in that, there is a spare one of each of those. So, so that's good at least. Um, but they normally, like, seem standard with these Chinese sets. You don't get a lot of spare pieces. They do try to make sure that you've only got what you need. Is that a little yarn there? Yeah. It's two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> We're building cars. wasn't quite sure at first 
that I had actually sorted all the pieces out correctly. Um, but the fact that we virtually ended up with no spare pieces, I'm pretty sure I've got them all correct. So I need stickers 6, 7 and 8. This is number six. <sighs> you sure you don't want one, two, and three? Yep. So six is a long one. It's going to go on this blue piece. Because he hasn't really shown you, it looks black over at your eyeballs. Um, but I can tell you now it's maybe and blue. As uh, as I mentioned in previous videos, these stickers are Crap. virtually no, the stickers are good, but just virtually the exact size required for the piece. So you have to get it exact because that was that was it's still what Jesus is like literally a fraction of a millimeter and. And the peak and the sticker goes off the end of the piece. And if you don't have great light, it's hard to uh, line up properly. So I've got that one now. Took three tries. So sticker six is gonna go on the end here. So right in the back of the piece. Was this seven? Yeah. So you won. And then eight is a big one again. Yeah, but just a I mean, you big probably one. can't I mean, tell, but just the size of that, that's the cover of one by one stud. It is the whole the whole surface of that stud. The Chinese have to be precise of everything. No, they, these are the these are the biggest stickers I've seen out of all the models that we've built so far is literally edge to edge that normally you get a little bit of a ring to it bit of a ring to it that's what he said anyway Oh, he's putting his stickers on. Let's do a little dance. Doopy doopy doop. Stickers don't even match up. Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> And there you have it. Yeah, but so there's like three stickers that make up this side panel. But the uh, they don't appear to <sighs> match up to one another. It's like that. That one. No matter which way around I put this, it's not going to match up to the other pieces. Oh, hang on, wait. This one. It's confusing where you put these little angle pieces. That one goes in the middle. Oh dear. Right. Martin has stuck the sticker <laughs> onto the piece of uh, paper. For a minute there, I thought it was going to be all over. This is a, a finely motor. Uh, the finely looks like a yeah. Ford so logo. So we've got, got three panels on the side there with three stickers on. 
So the stickers are so precise you can barely see the gap in between. <laughs> Have you seen how they spelt Mitchell? Mi Mitchell. Mitchell. With an M at the end. So we're on to step 12. Thank you. Couldn't be here all night. Yeah. So, so if you're watching, you're a bit bored, you can skip through if you'd like to see the finished product. But if you want to keep watching and uh, subscribe, just press the subscribe button. It's down here somewhere. I don't know where it is. Could be there. Could be here. Maybe it's up here. Or up here. God, these stickers are so <sighs> precise. If you think we're boring, give us a thumbs up <laughs> and subscribe <laughs> to us boring people. Oh yeah, I forgot. I thought, you, I thought I gave you more. Am I a sticker lady? Yes. Are you doing all this then? No, you can do some like that. That's because if I put stickers on, I'd probably bugger them up. So we've got the same stickers on the other side now. Okay. Actually, they were a little bit different. It was uh, 9 was 8, 10 was 7, and 11 was 6. Okay, other way around. Oh, Bert, what have you done to me now? You've made me yawn. As you can tell, his name's Little, I'm large, and I got titties on the table. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cover them up so they're not exposed. And... I mean, they're not exposed anyway, it's just, they like, they like to sit on things, you yeah. know. When I go out shopping, I have to put both melons in the trolley. And I need another trolley for my shopping. That's how I shop, girls. <laughs> and boys. <sighs> right. Now this is a piece not really a scene before. It, it's like two of those smaller angled pieces but just connected. So you've already got them connected. It's like on the front here I've just connected two in that exact same shape so they could have used one of those instead um, or instead used two of the smaller ones for this one. So I think that the reason they haven't is because this is going to connect to one stud on its left side. Well, I'll, I'll give you a little hint, Martin, the reason why they didn't do that is because they're master builders. Master builders can build whatever they want, and whatever brick they want. And yes, if you want to be a master builder, just get some Lego and build to your heart's content. Build whatever you want. The world is your oyster. Mind not score the table now. Eh? And there we go. 
There we go. So now we put the wheel arches on. <sighs> That's what he said. <laughs> oh dear. I'm so sorry, but I don't keep you on. It's not like it's bedtime or anything. So, this model is feeling pretty good so far. The pieces are all going together nicely and they feel good quality so I'm hoping that the uh, finished product is as good as the last two that we made because the last two were really good oh were they? yes now the reason why he's doing building it and not me this week is because he's got bloody 75 steps and we'll be here for two hours <laughs> <laughs> you can build a simple one. What's wrong with the two hours of listening to us? <laughs> oh dear. It was just three studs stuck together. So it's uh, two studs and a flat one. You need to speak up a little bit, Martin, because nobody can hear you in the last few videos. <laughs> Turn your volume up. I'm going to get Martin for his birthday, which is ages away, a megaphone. But if I do, probably the kids will probably want it. So maybe it's. A no go area. Right, I need 42 and 43. Are you talking about stickers now? Yes. Well, this is uh, speeding, it says. <laughs> hey. Which is this? I think your Star Wars game is calling. Where's my watch? It's telling you to do some bit the bugs. I think later we might have a little go on Sky Games. Test out the new. Neon game. So we've got stickers, two stickers put together. Just focusing on my face. That's because your face is so shiny. Um, it's me. This shiny, shiny, Martin shiny. That is what he would like to say the other day. Just calling himself a wee slap head. Back on Bill Bailey. Bill Bailey and how's everyone?
This one over here. Yeah. The red and the blue. Now, where do you want me to shove these? Right, I need stickers 50, 45 first. 45 first. There's 44, 45, and 46 all together. Yeah, I need 45. And then I need 44 and 46. Oh, excuse him, wow, picky. Right, this one's forty four next. Oh, excuse him, wow, again. <laughs> Hopefully, we might see him in a minute <laughs> later on. In this adventure, and there are so many stickers on this, but it should look pretty good when it's finished. It does kind of like the, uh, the Lego model, actually. There were a lot of stickers on that as well but that was uh, in keeping with the Mali branding and uh, all that imagery that you see on those I tell you what's got a lot of stickers I know a Rubik's Cube you know how many it's got about 25 million <laughs> unbelievable it's got ones that's triangles Lots of square ones. Cute bird. <laughs> ones that's a... Is it a circle? That turns into a diamond or some sort of thing? Hexagon. What I need to get on this, like, you know the big one? The big one that's got like about a million pieces in it. He'd love that. But there's no way I'm paying a hundred pounds for that. I won't want it anyway. I can see the kids getting out. <laughs> Ruining it the first day. Martin will never ever get to actually have a go to building it back together again. Because it would be... Cause it, and that, that's what they should do. You know those Rubik Cube people who do the races of the Rubik's Cube, they need to do it with the big massive one. No, because it takes like seven hours. <laughs> yeah, well, this takes seven hours. <laughs> so they need to, you know, I, I'd like that. See see who's the fastest at completing one of them bad boys. There you go, China. That's a challenge and a half for you. See if you can complete it in like about three seconds, just like a normal cube. Just sit there with your hands going. Voila! God, that looked like I was playing with imaginary balls. Mm. Just noticed I put two of these stickers on upside down. I give you the right way up as well. Men. Do you want something? Date yourself. What did you say would happen if you did the stickers? Well, it would be just like the Rubik's Cube. I take them off and I put them back on. <laughs> And then they start falling off. And then I've got to get my wee handy Gorilla Glue and stick it back on. There you go. So that Martin doesn't know that I've actually took them stickers off. He arranged them. <laughs> Can you see that? 
because that's how we do it, folks. That's how we do it. You want these pieces next? some of the, the detail on the back of the car and basically I just built that and it was like 15 small pieces and seven stickers five stickers so then this is just gonna stick straight onto the And they use those sideways facing studs to secure itself into place. Now we've got a lot of the back of the car complete. Hopefully the next few bits will be a little bit quicker. Oh, there's a song about that. Yes. Britney Spears sings it. I'm a slave for you. She gets her snake out and goes, I'm a slave <laughs> do that on Beat Saber. Can't do that song on Beat Saber. My daughter can. About a million times. She Next. likes that one. So as with uh, most of these models, especially the last two that we built, the, there was all this complicated layering that we're doing just you build it up layer by layer and there's literally no gaps anywhere so it's feeling pretty solid and ends up being quite heavy when you're finished as well it'd be interesting to see if the wheels uh, have the same problem that some of the other cheaper ones had because the axle does feel a little bit loose so I imagine it's going to have the same problem <laughs> oh, I thought I was going to get that one for you. <laughs> uh, right. I've accidentally got a black one there. Should have been blue. Like I said, they're so close in colour that especially because it's late and we've just got the lighting in this room. And the car is actually navy blue and not bright blue. Yeah. It's difficult to tell the difference between the blue and the black sometimes. I'm going to get you a pair of those colour blind sunglasses. So you can actually see what you're saying. That's what, 34 minutes and 55 seconds that we've been doing this. And as you can see, I mean, well, you can't actually see. I think we're about halfway. Yeah. 
Matt knows what he's doing. What am I here for? I don't know. Just says, I want you in my video because you made a beautiful video last time. Because you're my sex, he says. No problem. Fair enough. He goes, I want you to be so sexy in this video. So here I am. Being sexy for you all. Ain't that grand? As you can tell, Shadow's been playing with our models already before we've even done it. I feel like Two Face on this video. I've got half in here, half in the other one. You boys and girls can't actually see it. When Martin puts the camera on the thing, oh, that's pretty cool. this bit that he's just put on, it's like for your shopping. So if you want your shopping in your car, you just go uh, and stick it on, and then you can go meow really fast down the road. Your shop will stay put. There you go, Martin. Yeah. Need that. Until we start driving. I need a bus. I'm gonna buy a bus. An actual bus. I'm <laughs> gonna buy an actual bus. And everybody will go, oh look, there's my bus. Drive right past them, going beep beep. Ha <laughs> ha! You missed the bus. She would as often. Oh yeah, I think everybody would. Now I'm putting the front wheel arches on. Shall we get a bendy bus? Or one of them bendy bendy buses where there's like three fucking bendy bits. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yes. Imagine me driving that down the road. Yeah. I wouldn't be going down to the shop centre, that's for sure. I'd be going wherever the hell I want. Now that's, that's interesting because it's just had me put these curved pieces inside the front of the car uh, but they are wider than one brick is so it's hard to tell but the, the front wheel arches are angled slightly so I'm not quite sure how that is going to affect the model because uh, they're actually not straight so oh that's alright let's just put them on the wrong way around No, it's, if it's going to have me put something that's eight wide on here, it's, it's not going to fit very easily. Well, we'll get there when we come to that bit. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how it layers up on top of the... I think it just has a bonnet piece that fits in the middle. So, yeah. We'll see. I think there might just be a slight gap down the side of the, the wheels when it gets put together. That's what he said. <laughs> totally lost what step I'm on now. Uh, <laughs> step 32. That's the bottom of the page for anybody that's uh, following along. You'll not get any of these bricks inside the Lego box. What? You need to buy one of these cars. What's it called? I don't know. A pan, pan loss. A pan loss. From AliExpress. 
from AliExpress. That's where you've lost your pan on PUBG. Pan loss sounds like an actual place, doesn't it? Yeah. I bet there is actually. I bet, that, I bet that's where it's made. Pan loss. What in Greece? Anyway, in Greece. Yeah, it sounds like it's Greek, doesn't it? Pan loss. Don't know. Right, yeah, it doesn't need. sound like African or even Chinese or anything like that, does it? Sticker 23. Sounds somewhere that you would get go on PUBG, you know, on the on the desert map. What's it called? Miramar. 23, please. Oh, 23. I keep popping off these bottom pieces because then they're, they're not really attached with much. Oh, it's a triangle one. When I, when I give you it that way, that means it's the right way, right? Remember that. That's what he said. Uh, I'll put these bottom pieces in one brick. Right. There we go. Done the same on the other side, does it? What he's saying is that he's put them on Bobby the wrong there. place. Now he's fixed it. There we go. Right, what sticker do you want this time then? None yet. I will need 22 on the next step. It's another triangle. It's the other side of the triangle. Yeah. said I was sexy in the last video. I suppose I better be sexy in this video. My milkshake brings out the bullet to the yard and they're like, oh my god. And I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you even know the words? I could teach you. And I don't know why. Teach you what? <laughs> How to milk my duds. The, the. The look like studs. I don't know what I'm doing. Milking myself like a coo. Because <laughs> I'm sexy and yeah, you know. <laughs> I'm sexy and I know it. Doodly do 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 do. Doodly do 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 do. A chugga chugga. So yeah. last time you were talking. <laughs> You're talking to all the boys and girls. Is this is this one not for boys and girls now? Well, I actually did see <laughs> boys and girls earlier on, but you were not paying attention. I can't imagine your uh, Blue Peters presenters doing that. <laughs> well, Jimmy Savile was part of Blue Peter sometimes, wasn't he? Or was that Top of the Pops? <laughs> Oh, yeah, we always get those confused, don't we? I'm sure he 
Oh no, Jim will fix it, isn't it? Well, I don't think he did. Right, that is the first page of instructions done. Woo! Oh, and that's 45 that. minutes and 27 seconds. We've done the first page. Yeah. Hey everybody. You can go and put a kettle on. Make yourself a cuppa. Gonna be here all night the night. Listening to us. Keep knocking those bits off the bottom. Talk about random crap. Yeah. That's nice, isn't it? <clears throat> here we are. Watching. A young man. A young man. Young You've never man. called me that before. <laughs> An old man <laughs> trying to build a car. As you can see, he does not drive. He thinks he knows what he is doing. I don't need knows. to know how to drive. To he knows nothing. I'm surprised I don't need a sticker on there. There's no stickers on the uh, internal bits. Yeah, there, there is. Because here's a little doodah here, look, number 35. Alright. Oh, Let's go somewhere else. Well, I would say that that would go at the front there, where the steering wheel is. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Above it. Oh, it doesn't go there. No. Okay. Hang on. If you've got a. A wee man. And he's. Must be something else that they're gonna sit on because if, he, <laughs> if he's gonna sit there, <laughs> he can't see past the wheel. <laughs> yeah, he needs a cushion like my auntie Nan. She needed a cushion. Oh, she couldn't drive either. I don't think there is, you know. I don't think there's anything else that goes in there. And there's still more to build up on top of here. <laughs> he Are you he trying to say extra... that there is no doors? No, there's still doors going to go on it. But, um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure he's not going to be able to see out the window when he's in it. Well, he's a plastic figurine, Martin. Do you think he really wanted to go and see out the window? Well, he could always stand up if he wanted to. But I mean, that's disobeying the rules of gravity when driving. The rules of gravity. What the are rules they? of gravity. Right. Well, I'll stickers. tell you the rules of gravity. You standing up in a car 15. while it's driving at like 300 miles per hour, you're going to get fucking windswept. 15, 16, 17. Don't take a genius to know that. Please. You what? 16 and 17, did you say? 15, 16, 17. Right, this one's 15. Thank you. That was not straight at all. Here we are, giving the perfectionist the stickers to put on the car. As you can see, he has to wear his glasses. 
because he is blind as a bat. got a different type of wing mirror this time it's like a little piece that is made out of three pieces so that's going to stick out the side of the the door right Mart. do it's i kind, it's kind of in the in the middle of the door area which seems a bit strange is it this way no well it was last time yeah because i'd gone that way then I've got this way. Mm. Yeah, it does. I mean, the the Lego one didn't even have wing mirrors because they, they didn't put wing mirrors on these ones. Um, but the position of that wing mirror on that side looks a bit too far forward. So we'll see when it's all done. Well, what do you expect? I mean, how much was this one? About eight pounds, like all Eight pounds. Eight pounds. If my mum was on here, she'd say, oh, that's a bit expensive. Bought her a set of plates one time, and she had these set of plates in the 80s, you know, the, the blue ribbon octagon shaped plates or whatever it was, hexagon, I don't know, one of them shapes. Anyway, Indeed. said to my mum, I says, here you go, went to charity shop, three pound, three pound for like about 20 odd plates. Now oh, that's expensive that. So what I did was, I took them plates up to the till and paid for them. Oh, and there you go, there's a little story about my mum. And if you're watching, hello! Oh yeah, and now you want 13, yeah? Where? Can you imagine if he knocked all those beans off the table? Hey, listen, we did that mine the other day. <laughs> Just before we switched it on, we had the three little guys in the pink car and they had set it all up and everything. And I accidentally, well, I, I wasn't accident. I actually thought this was actually on. So I... I was playing about with my boobs and I put one here and I put one on here and one here and I just went like that with my boobs and I just went whack on the table and the wee guys went scattered across and mixed everything all over the place. How brilliant that day. So there we've got both sides of the car on. I'm surprised. I think now we've mostly got the front to finish. Uh, some more of the top detail. Surprised that no meow meows have actually come to say hello today. But there's always time. Wasn't that? That's like breaking into a bloody magnum, that with your teeth. Ooh, Indeed. imagine doing that with a magnum. Hey, Four, 48. What, 48 me? Yeah. Just number 48. 48 first. What? 48 first, and then we need 47 and 49. Alright, I see. It's this. Okay, this is 47.
So some of these stickers are more like Lego Dimensions. <laughs> so there. They actually do have a little bit of a gap. But some of those other ones, I think it's the ones where they're actually designed to cover a, cover a whole space or something. They've tried to actually make those very slightly bigger on purpose. I always like pieces like this where they use those small angled 45 degree pieces like side by side to just create that little curve. Don't mind me scratch my head. You got nips? No. Uh, right, I need stickers 4 and 5. Yeah, this one's number four. I think after this, Martin will be wanting to have a wee shot of his Undermine game. Anybody else uh, played Undermine? Uh, mention in the comments below. <laughs> Tell you what, I don't like don't like those wee bastards that nick all the cheese, <laughs> especially the big fat bastard and gets it all. But ten of them on his head. The pilfers. And then the wee bird will come. And hit and he'd go on, no, that's my cheese you get. And then eats it. And if he's if the wee bird is at level three, he eats all the cheese. And I must admit, whenever he goes to like level two digging, the music on it is pretty good. I could I could pretty Sit there all day long listening to that. Stick a two, and then you, you want number two, did you say? And then one and three. It's just blue. <laughs> like which way around is that sticker supposed to go? I just gave What's you. What's the point in putting a blue sticker on top of a white piece? Because why not? Like I said earlier on. The world is your oyster. You can make whatever you fuck you want. When I used to be at the school and I was a little... Uh, Shit. No. I was a helper at this other school one time. And the teacher said that she wanted everyone to copy her jack-in-the-box that they were supposed to make and the, all the little kids were like oh do I have to make it green the box green and do I have to make the face orange and I said to them no oh god that was shit I <laughs> says you you can make whatever colour you want it didn't look too bad make that it sticker. unique it, uh, it was one and they did. And the teacher took me to the side and said, why did you do that? And I thought, well, why should everybody have the same? If that one wants a black little face or a, a pink little stem thing or a red eyeballs or whatever it wanted, it can they can have whatever they want. Yep. And I was there for a week. It's my, you know, you know when they do that um, school placement thing to see if you would uh, do stuff at, the, at, at wherever it was that you wanted to be when you grew up and I wanted to be a teacher to start off with and I changed my mind and now I am <laughs> and a mum and a nurse 
And I cook. I'm a chef. I'm a head chef. <laughs> well, like your dad was. I'm a first class iron nurse. Oh, <laughs> it was the last time I ironed. <laughs> but ten year ago. It's whatever I put in the dryer. Alright, 24 and 25. Again. Oh, it's triangles the end, again. I think. What are you talking about? Look how, look how it still looks like half built, but there's not a lot of pieces left. It goes that way. I know this you you hate to get your cheesy what's it's out. Um, yeah, see a couple of cobwebs on the wall. That's nice, isn't it? Cheers. What we're celebrating? I'll tell you what we're celebrating. Finishing this one. Woo! Step fifty three, and I need thirty seven, thirty nine, thirty seven. All oh, right, but there's side panel -y things, and then at thirty eight is a big blue one that's. Here's 37. Uh oh. Looks like he's done a boo boo. There's a big, there's a big white piece that I've not. Is it this one? Quite in. No. Uh, is it a big long one like that? No. Oh, I know what I've done. That's alright. It was these, uh, the pits where the steering, you know when I said the steering wheel is really high, that white piece is supposed to be in front of these. So he's so, got a seat in the end now, is this the seat for him to sit on? No, so, so this white piece was supposed to be in there, and then the, the wheel. So you can see over the steering wheel now. Uh, right, it's uh, 37. Yeah, and I need 39. Well, folks, that's over an hour and four minutes and 23 seconds of your life ruined. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, I thought you picked that up. <laughs> so like I said earlier because the, there's a very slight slant, uh, it can, you can sort of squeeze it together. When it, so, yeah. uh, so now we need to stick 41. 
It's only gonna it's only telling me to put one on this side. There must be one on the other side, number forty. Yeah, there is. Oh it's alright, it tells you later on to put forty on. So I'll need forty and forty one. You want forty and forty one right now? Yeah. It's yeah. gonna go on the side of these. Forty coming up first? Strong, come on. <laughs> you know what's strong. And it ain't what you guys are thinking. But I know what's strong. Gorilla glue. <laughs> <laughs> hard as nails, that. And no, 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 you don't need hard as nails or no more nails. Gorilla glue is your best friend. Just stick that bastard on any wall and voila, you can put your chair up there and you'll never fall off. <laughs> I minded that advert, no Don't more nails. That <laughs> That's what they did, no more nails, years ago. They put a chair on the bloody roof, on the wall. The guy sat on it, I'm sure he sat on it upside down. <laughs> and you'll never fall off. Oh, Jesus Christ, who, who puts a chair up on the wall? Unless you're one of them artists who ain't an artist who thinks they're an artist, oh, but they're not. Right, here now, is. are you saying, oh God, because of what I'm saying about artists? No. Because there are some really, really good artists out there. But the majority of them. <laughs> I need uh, 18, 19, 20, 21. Hit uh, the, the thumb up button and uh, tell me below on the comments how much do you like artists no, no one's even watching at this point they're all just skipping through going when's he gonna finish it just like uh, Moby Dick backwards <laughs> he should actually say the words backwards as well mm. so that when you play that's for version two when yeah, you play it it'll be like yum, 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 yeah, we'll be like, all right what number was it sorry 18 19 20 21 oh okay all right so a couple of triangles here there's your 18 oh dear me I don't know which way around these are supposed to go. Well, it's the way that I put it. <laughs> if it comes off that way and I give it to you that way, that's how you put them on. Watch Martin, or Martian, that's what my mum likes to call him. Uh, Fuck up! Hey! How many views have we had so far, Martin? What, on this one? I know, not on this one, because this ain't live. Well, it is live right now, but when you guys watch it, it would be like Dave, it was on like three years ago. Was it the most views is the Logan's one? Uh, not sure. See, I, I don't know. I don't really go on YouTube that much. But we're going to make an example and be on YouTube just for you guys. Because you guys are the best. You really support us in everything that we do. Thank you so much for being our friend, because we have none. <laughs> Gotta sing a wee song as what everyone used to sing years ago. Why are we waiting? So you can sing YMCA. <laughs> <laughs> Why are we waiting? Oh, why are we waiting? 
That's yeah. a lovely song, that. So that is uh, quite a big chunk of the back of the car, complete there. Now we're just adding all this extra curves and everything on the top. <sighs> uh, what the <hell> is that? <laughs> Man, you've been reading it wrong. It's not six six six. It's nine nine nine. I'm a bit disappointed in this video. There's no meow meows. Meow meows makes it even that extra special. I need to stick fifty two. Oh, 52. All right, this is like an L-shaped one. Yeah. And... 50? 50. And 51 that says speeding. No. no? definitely a lot of fiddly bits on this model compared to the last one but it's just lots of little details sorry I thought there was a fiddly bit <laughs> <laughs> I really did it, it looked like there was something hanging off your arm and I thought what was that Thirty-two. All right, you're talking to me. <laughs> it's me in Wonderland. I'm dreaming of. Oh, it's a big long one. It's a limited edition. Limited edition. You can't see. I mean, you can't even see what he's doing. I mean, he needs like something like a vehicle to see what he's actually. And then I need thirty-five and thirty-six. Dirty dive. Oh, it's these ones. Dirty six. What do you think, Martin? Should we buy a bus or should we buy one of them caravans like Ben 10 RZ things where everyone's all sitting in with your seatbelt on and you be in the kitchen or whatever? There's me driving. I'm not going to be in the kitchen while I'm driving. Well, I mean, all the wee seats at the back. Get pimp my ride on and make the, the thing all by yourself. Look at these, look at these. They don't like sit up the way, you know, you'd think with a bra that they would go nicely, but no, no. On the table they go. Right, 26, 27, 28. 
26. Now, when I pass you this one, it is upside down for a reason because this is the way it is. I got big titties and I cannot lie. You motherfuckers can't deny. When my tits walk in, everybody stops and has a look and yay! <laughs> they get big and they're in your face and everybody's saying, what a fucking disgrace. Oh my god! Put them away! Do you think they're fake? No! They're real! When a girl walks in with an itty bitty waist and you just what, get your tit and smack her across the face and you get yay! So there we go. Stick that six long piece across. There's a. Uh, across those wheel arches where they were sort of squeezed together. Slave, please. And then we need to stick a thirty eight. I can't reach these ones, man. <laughs> My titties just won't let me. Thirty eight, did you say? Oh, the yeah. big square one. So yeah, if you like that song, it'll be uh, on Amazon soon. Need some more uh, music. Mm. What would you like me to sing for you? And I'll do my own version. <laughs> if you know what song I should sing next, write it in the comments below. And uh, thumbs up and subscribe. Whatever that is. Down here? Is it, or is it here, here? I don't know. So we're now filling in the front of the car with stickers. Woo! We're nearly there. My shoulders are. Wait, which Says is he. this? I've just showed you the way. The way it goes which that is way. It? Jesus. Is it 33 or 34? It's 33. You know that 33 comes before 34, so I'd give you the 33 first. Uh, here we go, upside down, back to front, and side it. Just like your underwear, everybody. You wear them for six months one way. <laughs> six <laughs> months the other way. Turn them inside it and do the other way, and then turn them again for the other way. If you have a wee hole poking it, don't worry. If it's at the back of your arse, it's alright. Now, that little. It's alright for a shite. Fold that was in the uh, sticker sheet. 
mm -hmm. did actually break that stick up there. But I managed to stick it down. Well, you, you could see, always... You can see where the bolts went through those pieces there. You can always see that in the comments of, uh, of the thing. I will do one of your next pieces please. I can't reach that one. As you can see here's our male stripper on the table. Shoes speeding. Oh, look at that. Three more stickers to go. Thank God, because we'll be wanting a wee shot of his uh, undermining before we get go to bed. You can sit there, shake the heat on it, man. While he's doing 63. that, a wee bit. There's no 63. There's no 63. So, what does that mean? 63. No, um, 51 is like the last one. I don't know what that, that goes means. It's, it, it's not a sticker, it just says 63. Point. Oh, this one says 51. What the hell? <laughs> Maybe going back to the to the um, doodads. No, because no, 63 is pointing in those two pieces. It's pointing to this wing there and it says 63. And on a previous one, and here it says 49. On, I hadn't noticed those numbers before. I don't know. 38? I don't know what they mean. No, but you'll be alright. We've only got 29, 30, and 31 to put on. That's what's left. Yeah, and those, those are going to stick on there. I need those. So. Then we can build the wheel. You want 29? Yeah. I hope you all love us while you're watching us doing all this. Is this thing? Now, I know I haven't said it before previously and so many times, but if you hit the subscribe button down below, you can watch more of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Click the like button, which is like one of these, and uh, comment and tell us how much you feel about us, how much you love us so much, and how sexy I am. Smoking. That's what I am. Smoking. No, I don't smoke, by the way, if anybody is wondering. I'm not that kind of girl. So this goes on top of... So that, that's actually a thing. I think I'm doing the things wrong, but I might be doing it right. Who gives a toss? So that was a uh, quite a complex build, but it feels really good and solid. Other than just these small pieces just on the bottom, uh, just keep popping off whenever I'm handling the, the model. 
appears like a big solid shit, especially when I have to chop it up with a brush. Right. So the, the guy at least can just about see over his steering wheel now. And if we put the glass part on the top. So Laura's just finishing the wheels. We'll put those on in a second. I just realised I put this part on uh -oh. backwards. Bye bye. centimeters so there we have it it's fully complete uh, looks like a Colin McRae yeah exactly it's supposed to so yeah I think design wise it's really well done it's, it's interesting to look at it compared to the Lego model to see the little well, come similarities. On. Come on, Martin, let's compare it and to the Lego model. So this is the smaller six wide brick version that Lego made and this is the the larger eight wide brick that we've just built. So uh, they are pretty similar in design. Uh, we've got that little wing on the back and those red lights there. Uh, it's a bit blocky on the back but so is this one actually so he probably is close to the, the actual design of the car it's got that big like turbo cooler thing on the front which I'm not quite sure oh it's not it's, it's the lights actually um, yeah so it looks pretty cool I think the only thing that lets this entire model down is the character and um, because it's got like one of those cheap looking mega block style minifigures in it uh, but the model overall is pretty cool. I'm not quite sure I, I would say it is as good quality as the last two that we built because those were really good. Um, and your stickers, but this is, half this of your is stickers probably, were bent. I would probably say this is the, the third best after those, those last two that we built. This is a really cool model and it kind of stands out as being a bit unique as well. Um, we did get the the Audi Quattro uh, rally model last year from Lego, so uh, that would probably be a good comparison next to this as well. I'll go grab that in a second. Um, so we'll just see if it actually runs. And it's pretty much, it's got the same problem that most of these cars have. Um, as soon as you put the model down, its tyres just touch the, the wheel arches, so it, it just won't roll naturally. I think if you did put in Lego axles um, and maybe substitute for the Lego wheels, that might not be a problem. I'm definitely going to have to try that, but I'll talk about that on a future video. So I will just grab the Quattro as well for a comparison. Well, he's away off for a wee shite, or shall I say a big one? Let's see how fast he was. <laughs> wow. so, so last year uh, Lego made this model, um, kind of one of the most iconic rally cars and I suppose this is a iconic rally car but 20 years newer. So side by side um, they have don't actually have the same wheelbase, so this one has wider wheelbase on it, but that's because the the Quattro sort of did have a short wheelbase, uh, and I think I quite like the blocky design of this one, which did goes with that that style, and then obviously it's got the official branding on everything that Lego can do. 
uh, the lights are a bit wonky on the front and this is a more modern curved smooth model but I think side by side they look pretty nice on display so yeah I would recommend this set because it's a bit different uh, you get a lot of sports cars and super fast cars and things in these these type of styles so it's nice to have something a bit different have a rally car in it um, so yeah definitely pick that up from eight pound eight pound from aliexpress it's a pretty cool model that will join your collection um, next time we probably are going to be doing another sports car i've got another one that's styled on like a ford gt style track car so i think i'll do that one next and maybe have one of the the boys join me again so thank you for helping I'm laura tiny. Don't you want me back? You, you can help in one of the other ones. I'm trying to vary it a bit. I still want Damien to do one as well. He doesn't want to do any. I know. So, thank you for watching and until next time. He would rather talk about the history. <laughs> right, bye bye everyone! Bye bye! <laughs>